Hey Joe, uh, what's up? Just uh, learning web design. In six months, I'll be a guru of Photoshop, CSS, JavaScript, HTTP, HTTPS, everything. That's great. Uh, show me the website you're working on. My website? I'm still learning. I'll build my website after I've learned everything. Dude, if, if you want to learn something, you have to do it hands-on. Don't just eat a, a bunch of books. I just started reading Photoshop, and then I'll read CSS, HTML. Okay, okay. What if I show you how to build a website in, in the next 20 minutes? You're kidding. No way. Joe, dude, trust me. We're going to build a website right now. Just tell me the theme of your website. Theme? Theme. Soups. Vegetable soups. Afterthought. Let's, uh... Let's get some soup first. Uh, no. Website first, then soup. We are going to build an awesome website using pure HTML5 in this demo. A note, however, though, building complete websites using just HTML is difficult and daunting task, especially when you have lots of content. Soon, it becomes too difficult to maintain the website. Building website using WordPress is easier. See the other tutorials for information on building websites using WordPress. Let us start by installing a good text editor first. One of my favorites is Notepad++. It is a free text editor. Yet another free text editor with lots of features is Atom. We have installed Notepad++ successfully. Let us create an index.html file now. This will be the home page for my new website, vegso.com. Now, for this site, we will use Bootstrap CSS Framework. So, why use a CSS Framework? You can quickly build a beautiful website that works on all browsers and devices. No need to reinvent everything from scratch. For Bootstrap, the documentation is very nice and there are lots of examples too. Go to getbootstrap.com. We will fetch the basic template. Get the CSS links and insert your page. Now, edit the HTML contents. For lead copy, Bootstrap already has a CSS class ready. We just use it. Now, we will preview the page in the browser. Our HTML page is ready. Now we have to get it online. In the next step, we will register the domain name and get the hosting for our brand new website. We will host our website with SiteGround Web Hosting. SiteGround is known for its super-fast web servers, security features, and awesome support. This link takes you to the best hosting offer they have. I will choose this hosting plan, since it allows me to host my future websites with the same account. Enter the domain name to register. Enter the contact information. Give special care entering a good, long password. I know, you already know the importance of keeping the password safely. Enter the payment information. I will uncheck the domain privacy and the extra security features for now. However, those are good features and do enable them while building serious websites. Press the button and proceed.
our website is ready to go. Setting up a website is so quick and easy with SiteGround. I go to them every time I build website. We can go to the customer area straight from here. I will close this help screen for now. Let me check my email address to see whether I got any email about my new website setup. Here it is. Click on this link to go to your customer area. Enter the username from this email. Enter the password you had entered while creating the account. We are in the customer area of the hosting account. Click the My Accounts tab here. This page has all the information you need to manage your website. Clicking on this cPanel button takes you to the Control Panel page. You have all those buttons to manage everything related to your website in here. Here you have buttons to install WordPress, take a backup, add subdomains, password protect your pages, and so on and so forth. I will explain each of them in different tutorials. Let us go back to the My Accounts area. Here we have the FTP login details. FileZilla is a free FTP client. Let us download and install FileZilla. We have FileZilla ready. Now let us log in through FileZilla to my website. It will show you the files and folders in my web hosting account. The HTML files are to be uploaded to this public underscore HTML account. Let us upload the files. There, your website open to everyone. However, the website is pretty basic. Let us add a little more content to the HTML page. The Bootstrap website has several layout examples. This one matches the layout I had in mind. Go to View Source to see the source HTML of this page. Here we have the CSS style specific to this page. We copy those styles to a new file. Then link that CSS file to our HTML page. Now we will get this HTML body template. Now, customize the content. We have updated our HTML page with new content. We also have a starter style sheet ready. Now let us upload those new files and see how it looks. Wow! See, you can build your HTML site quickly using a framework like Bootstrap. Now you can keep improving your design step by step, customizing the content, adding background images, updating colors, and so on. We have set up your website in less than 20 minutes. Click this link to download this guide as a PDF ebook. You can refer to it when you are building your own website.